explaining next to normal to someone is actually kind of complicated because when I tell you what it's about, you're going to be like, well, why would I ever want to watch a show like that? Because it's essentially about uh, a family dealing with trauma in different ways. There's mental illness, there's drug abuse. It's just, it's it runs the gamut of of people dealing with terrible events happening to them. But what makes the show absolutely fantastic is that there's always a little bit of hope, right? There's There's something that we're striving for, and the music is absolutely beautiful and it's only six actors on stage and I for one love seeing just like a group of powerhouse actors tell an amazing story to me and this is that next to normal is that you will see the show and you will absolutely leave the theater being affected in some way and hopefully for the better it does end at least on kind of a positive note um, without giving anything away but it's it's just a really powerful story that I think everybody needs to hear It's funny because this this is essentially the opposite of Clue, right? Clue I approached very much almost like a dance piece. It was highly choreographed. Comedy is so specific that it's only funny if it's just right. Whereas this is the opposite. This is character work, story, music that's all telling this beautiful story together. And so for Clue, for example, we didn't talk about the story of Clue until about three weeks into a three and a half week rehearsal process. In this rehearsal process, day one, we're talking about who are these people, what's going on with them, because that's what we're here to see for this one. Um, and it's been so rewarding because I have such a great group of people and they're coming in with their ideas and I've got my ideas. So we really get to have this dynamic conversation about who these characters are and what, why we're telling this story. And it's been great. If you come see this show, it's beautiful. The music will get stuck in your head in the best and maybe the worst possible way, but it's also just, it's a really relatable story. It, it's, it's just a regular family who are dealing with terrible circumstances and, and how they deal with that and how they persevere and move on and keep going is a story that we can all relate to. And, and I think, you know, with all the stuff that's happened over the past few years in the world, and it's just, all the stuff that may be happening to you, it's nice to see someone go through something and keep going. And at the end of the show, you're gonna be like, yes, I can keep going too. And I think for that alone, it's worth seeing. Mm -hmm.